What's up, what's up, what's up? What's up guys, your girl Ariana, that cute little brown girl, everybody with a little taste of, hey, hey, hey. And today I'm back with something a little different. Actually, I haven't really did a story time in a really long time or like a journey process type of thing, but I am going to start it now. A lot of hand motions going on. Anyway, I'm I haven't done this video in a long time. I'm gonna insert some pictures and stuff too. Hopefully I'm fancy enough and I remember. But anyway, before we get into the video, I need y'all to like, comment, and subscribe. Team Mary all day, every day. If you didn't know, now you know. I need y'all to go ahead and hit that thumbs up button. Get this video to 10,000 likes right here, right now. Is this focusing? I'm just trying to make sure it's focused. <laughs> and I wanted a close up. Oh, 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 yeah. Anyway, so listen. Here's the, here's, here's what this is all about. So, how do I say this? I'm a confident person. I love myself. I really do. And um I you know what I'm saying? We we all have been doing this whole positive thing. And so I wanted to let y'all know because I'm I really I don't believe in lying to y'all and telling y'all fake stuff so that way y'all you know y'all don't know I'm just boom. But as you can tell by the title, you know, this conversation is about liposuction. And so for those of you who know and those of you who don't know for my younger audience, for my babies out there, I want y'all to know that um liposuction is like, you know what I'm saying, it's a it's a surgery. It uh you you know, they take out the fat you know the fat cells in designated areas that you want your chin your cheek your forehead whatever your arm your underarms this right here they take it all and you know what i'm saying boom it's gone you know some people get it and they inject it in other places that's up to you but for me specifically um i have decided you know that i wanted to go forward with you know my thoughts of liposuction liposuction for me myself and what i want to do and for those of you guys know i always talked about my you know i don't like my stomach and when I was younger, I always was like a size 120 and like I'm more than 120. I'm not going to get into details. <laughs> but yeah, like I weigh more than 120 right now. And so, of course, I gained a lot of weight after um, I got pregnant with my baby Dan. But um, <laughs> like when I was younger, I, you know, I used to be kind of, I was getting big and I had went on this really unhealthy diet where I wasn't eating at all. And like, you know, a lot of like medical issues, you know, had, you know you know came or whatever and i lost like a whole bunch of weight and i was so small i could literally sit fit in size fives and sevens and you know now my size is more and of course after i had daniel you know stuff was going I, you know i love food i can't give up food i will never be able to give up food but pretty much let me show y'all a picture of let me show y'all a picture of how i looked when i was like like young so this is me in uh like uh middle school middle school freshman year this is when i had like i was really small like i was so flexible like look at me i'm bending and stuff i can't do that no more and this is me um when i went to a fair back in fort wayne like i was really really small i believe this is freshman or sophomore year uh no sophomore year this is sophomore year right here with this um little red outfit on and it's like three of me and you know what I'm saying, I feel like I'm all cute and stuff, but I'm trying to show y'all like how small like my upper body was. Like you could see my bones so easily. Like it was like this. <laughs> but um that and like these are just over the years. That's like 2000, like I don't even want to say the years because I really don't even know. But like I had like a lot of moments where I've been wanting to change stuff. And so I'm gonna show you like three different stages of like my body. So you have the first stage, which is you know, 2000 and what is this is where this is like 2017 um with the blue swimming suit and i'm posing this one i went to orlando and i went to playlist for the first time and then you have the pink outfit which is the pink the pink top with the blue bottoms and that's 2015 when i was in college and i went to um miami for spring break with my best friend kendra and then you have you know 2018 with the red bathing suit of me now with um when i went to orlando with spicy mafia you know and so when you look at that and you look at the other pictures and i love each picture i love each stage of my life but i'm to the point now where i love my body i'm just not a big fan of my stomach and i've tried dieting and like it has a lot to do with my birth control that i have right here and um i have the arm I've, it's actually been three years i got it right before i went to college and so it's been three years. Actually, it's time for me to get it taken out and either get a new one or, you know. But my plans are actually to get, you know, to get it out and go ahead and get lipo. And then 
I feel like after I got birth control, I kind of like blew up. Like if you look at my old pictures, freshman year, high school, and then like um, if I can find a pregnancy picture, I'll throw it in here too. But I, it, it, I don't know. Like I had lost a lot of photos, sadly, of my pregnancy and stuff. And so, as you can see, like it's kind of like my opinion on libel section is that you're supposed to love your body and that's what i push out to all my young ladies out there i'm not sitting here like oh i hate my body i'm gonna change this but i do know that i'm feeling so confident so when i get this i'm gonna feel like even more and like i'm not just going straight into lipo and my plan is not to get it and then just keep getting it and eat how i want to it's kind of like i'm doing a cheat sheet and then after that i'm going to maintain it afterwards because i know the kind of person i am it's been kind of hard for me to lose a lot of weight like you guys see when i was dieting you can kind of see the inches and stuff but it was hard for me to lose weight and get where i wanted designated because of my birth control you know and i went to the doctor and they're like well you can either get birth control out and kind of defeats the purpose of birth control or you can you know keep it in and kind of just try not to eat as much and kind of maintain where you at but like we hear a lot that you it's hard for you to you know uh you know lose weight like we have this problem with other girls but you know it's birth control you need it <laughs> but it's kind of like when i look at it i'm like if i don't have birth control then i'll be able to get lipo and i'll be able to like feel good like you know i'll be able to take the pictures i want it's kind of like giving myself a booth of confidence and i feel like i earned it like i want to get lipo and then get my personal trainers in houston so if you're a personal trainer in houston please hit me up i'm trying to work out but like i'm kind of gonna it's like i'm cheating but i'm not cheating it's like i'm gonna cheat get this body that i want and then after i get the body that i want then i'm gonna you know bring it back down and I'm just going to be positive, but I wanted y'all to know because I don't want y'all to be like, oh, look, and I want to show y'all like how my body is right now. Let me move this back. I'm just going to stand on this. Sorry, Miki King. So look, this is my stomach now. So this is like me chilling, relaxed. You see, like this is like me really chill, relaxed and everything like that. And I kind of wanted to go from here to, to here. Do you see the difference? And so that's my goal. And so that's my major plan to go from here, like fat jiggling and you know what I'm saying, all these little that's going on to snatched and you know what I'm saying, a little bit smaller and stuff. And I really want like my love handles right here gone. And like that's all I'm really trying to fix like at the moment. <laughs> and so I love my body. I really do. And I feel like if you love your body and you're confident, changing stuff about you does not make you not love your body. And I want to tell all the females that's out there to love your body because you know what I'm saying? Like we in a position of being public figures that I feel like we need to communicate. Like so that way y'all don't start assuming like assuming can get you in so much trouble. I mean like it's just bad. Like it's just really 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 bad. And so I just wanted to keep y'all updated tell y'all my opinions on liposuction please comment down below like your opinions and everything because i care about you guys we are a family and i will not stop stressing that we are a family and y'all come first um i just wanted y'all to see why i felt this way and show y'all pictures like your girl used to be small and i'm not trying to get that small like the picture that i look scary in i'm trying to get kind of like here to I'm trying to get in the middle of where I'm at now. But I need y'all to like, comment, and subscribe. Team Airy all day, every day. If you don't know, now you know. Comment down below if you want me to share the process with you when I, you know, set up the appointment this month. And when I get it and like the healing process and the results, which I plan to. Because um, my plan is to keep y'all involved in everything that I do in my life, you know. But I love y'all. Team Airy all day. If you didn't know, now you know. Hit that thumbs up button and comment down below. Make sure you subscribe. On the road to a million. Right now, we're hitting 700K. So I need y'all to go ahead and subscribe right now while you're watching the video. You, 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 Um, thank you for watching. It's your girl, Ariana. Did I say that already? That cute little brown girl, everybody will say so. Hey, hey.